Hey, we're Confidence Man. And we covered Heaven by DJ Sammy for Like A Version. Yeah, we like disco days. Um, and we wanted to cover something that was like 90s rave vibe. Um, and we played it in a DJ set a few times and it's been going off. So. Yeah, it needs to come back, so yeah. we're bringing it back. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's got to be that riff, the the chords. Yeah, it's pretty much like just a... So turbo. That riff's perfection. Like, yeah, yeah. You, and it's not in the original, like DJ Sammy added that in himself. Yeah, so, yeah that's all DJ, you, Sammy. DJ Sammy. Thanks, Sammy. Yeah, so this was an original Brad Adams. We didn't actually know that. Our manager, Stu, who's old, told us that. Yeah. Um, and we listened to it and like, it's not that good. Pretty much this is the song we would have wrote if like we were smarter. So um, <laughs> yeah, we pretty much just beefed it up a bit. Mm -hmm. I did some yelling mm -hmm. um, and just, yeah, like put like a little bit of extra turbo juice on top I, of it. I think usually when you kind of play something uh, as a band, like it kind of becomes your own anyway. So I kind of think like the DMB element that kind of stuff, it automatically kind of makes it sound like us anyway. So it wasn't, we didn't have to try. Yeah, yeah and then of course those sick dance moves. Yeah. Yeah. We tried to cover um, the bass song. Uh, totally addicted totally to the bass. bass. That was terrible. Yeah. Um, yeah Freestyler. Kylie, Kylie, Freestyler. Yeah, yeah. Um, it was a long, long list. Yeah. And then somehow we just sort of like realized this would be perfect. I think we were out drunk and we played the song and we we're like, this would be perfect. And we probably did that with like 50 songs, but mm. this one was the one that finally landed. Yeah. Janet basically like locks me in a room um, and just like beats me into submission. Yeah, I mean, usually I have like a million references in my phone. A lot of them like Janet Jackson. Anyway, I just save anything I like. Sometimes it's like a Jew, that, remember that Jewish move we did back in the day? That kind of stuff, mm. like get it from everywhere. Yeah, yeah, from everywhere. Yeah. We, nothing is left yeah. untouched with us. Yeah, and then I kind of see what he's comfortable with doing. Sometimes he says no. There was one move when we were on the ground doing this weird hump move and you refused to do that. Yeah, no. That was so offensive. That. Just do what I say. No. <laughs> Oh, I mean, the Matrix move, like, I was quite, quite pr pleased with that. Oh, like, yeah. the slow-mo, bend down. Yeah, the I wasn't sure if I was going to be able to sing at the same time, but that worked out. Yeah, the back bend off. Yeah. Right. And it was also hard, like, fitting <laughs> this many dance moves into this tiny, like, little room. Like, yeah, but we didn't break anything too bad. Nah, so, well, like, that's... Invoice us for that. Yeah, yeah, just invoice us. Thanks, John Jay. Oh, I mean, I've watched this, like, since I was a kid, so, you know, it's pretty exciting. I think everyone's pretty yeah, excited about totally. it. Yeah, totally. Like, it's something that, like, we've grown up with and... Probably seen like hundreds of different like versions over the years, and like, yeah, it feels amazing to just get involved. Yeah, and I can't wait to offend all the fans. People are yeah. gonna be mad about this, I can feel it. <laughs> Love it or you hate it. Yeah. Uh. <laughs>